All right, in order to factor this polynomial here, what we need to do is pull the greatest common factor out. There's a L factor of three is in there, so we'll put a three out. The largest factor we can put out for y is y to the fourth. Then what you have left over here is three y squared. Okay, it's because if you multiply this out, you should have nine y to the sixth. Next one you have one and to four, that's y, plus uh, eight left. Okay, so all you have to do is factor this one over here. The easiest thing you can factor on this one is um, do this vertical method. Okay, you have a y here, three y here. So when you multiply them, you have a three y squared. Okay, and then you need another thing over here that's come up to be eight. When you multiply them, you should have eight. So four and two, and that's eight. You also can have one eight and eight one and two four as a combination. But two four over here gives you the correct combination because when you cross multiply and then you add them together, that gives you the 14 y. Okay, let's try it out. So y plus four times three y plus two, that gives you under barely here, you have a 3y squared okay, plus 2y. And then you do the top hat here, and you have plus 12y and plus 8. Okay, that gives you 3y squared plus 14y plus 8, just like what we needed. Okay, so our original equation becomes, if you remember what we had, we had a 3y to the fourth. And then once we factor the stuff inside, we have y plus 4 times 3y plus 2. All right, have a confident day.